Hi, my name's Kay Bora, but my friends call me Kay. It's much easier to pronounce, and you can say you can spell it with one letter. A uh, little introduction. Uh, for the last three years, previously been known as Kibor the Gun Bunny. Previously being a walking, living, I don't know whether you call it an irony. Uh, being in love of, you know, guns and firepower, but you know what? Um, I'm unarmed tonight, so I'm just a bunny. <laughs> Apparently, Russ didn't like the idea of me catching bullets with my teeth, so. <laughs> Not safe enough for this venue. I only have two to catch them with. But uh, <laughs> any case, I think I get started. I'll tell you a little about who I am. My heritage is uh, half Ger German giant, 25% uh, Irish lop, and 25% that can't be yet determined by human science. <laughs> any case, um, yes, these pick up HBO, but no, not in HD. <laughs> They're only doing reruns right now, so don't worry. Um, hey, I like Sopranos, but... Uh, any case, what are we talking about tonight? Easter, right? Well, my family's always celebrated Easter, being... Uh, <laughs> it's kind of a given, you know, you can't not celebrate it, so... But I got, uh, I don't know my sister's here tonight, she's a model, actually. <laughs> But uh, mm. not tonight. I don't think she, she's here yet. No, nope, she's not here yet. But I do have my brother here. Uh, he's a musician too. I hope he'll perform up here soon. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh yeah. But uh, he had a band uh, called Stain Stain Glass, not stained, not with the ed, without it, because Ed left the band. So. Um, <laughs> Stained Glass, you can look them up on, uh, I think it was MySpace, Stained Glass uh, NM, stand for New Mexico, because uh, I was that rabbit that took a long, wrong left turn in Albuquerque. <laughs> I got stuck there and lived there for four years. I figured while I'm, while I'm lost, I might as well get a college degree here, and I did. And you can see it, uh, University of New Mexico and a whole thing. And then I found out I had to take a right, and I got back to Texas. All right, so <sighs> I'm gonna leave all the Albuquerque jokes for next time. <laughs> it's a list. Um, but yeah, you could. Ch and I was just pro I was just pushing my brother's U MySpace because I found out recently that all of their songs are up there for free, and you can actually listen to them. So, but it's uh the band broke up, but it's you know, but there's stuff still there. And uh, did you get that? Did you get that gig with uh, Energizer yet? Because he's the drummer, actually. You know. <laughs> yeah. Hey. <laughs> going and going. Uh, hey, I always liked the idea of an Energizer bunny with a full drum set. An endless drum solo running on Energizer is a lot better than that single drum. You know. <laughs> okay. Well, here to talk about Easter, so kind of break it down. Here's what Easter is. It's a mix of two holidays. You have the Christian holiday of, you know, the rebirth of Christ, and you have the pagan holiday of uh, spring, rebirth, and fertility, which, yeah. So yay, fertility. May the seeds of your loins be fruitful in the belly of your woman. Okay. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but kind of break it down I, I couldn't find very many good Easter jokes so I was probably going to keep it short tonight because uh, Phobos and Demos like to melt my face so I think I'd tell a few good one-liners but I think we'll get to start on one person I need to grill right now because he's you know cr making the rest of us look bad his name is the Easter Bunny but hey um, <laughs> yeah, we got some people that, yeah, yeah, against the machine, er. Um, <laughs> well, we got to break it down. Who's the Easter Bunny? Well, uh, I think he's a little bit of a crazy psychopath, a little bit of a criminal because he, he's breaking and entering into your home. 
Uh, he's taking the eggs out of your fridge, painting them, hiding around your house, and giving your kids candy. Is this really what you want? <laughs> and he's not Santa Claus, but yet he has kids sitting in his lap at the mall. That makes no sense to me. <laughs> Yeah, a little, a little awkward. What do you, it's like, what kind of candy would you like in your uh, eggs this year? <laughs> it's the concept. I never got it, and no, to this day I haven't sat in his lap, but if I ever did, uh, I'd show up like this and be like, where do you get off? <laughs> Brought a few things with me today. I figured you never can find a carrot big enough. Now I do. I was gonna nap on this later anyway. Oh. Uh, well, I had a couple of quick one-liner jokes for you. Now I'll go ahead and tell them. Uh, since it's Easter, I gotta make it Easter themed. So, um, first of all, someone told me that, you know, if, if you could be something Easter themed, you know, they said, well, obviously you'd be the rabbit, right? It's like, <laughs> no, <laughs> but, <Fantastic>. yeah, <laughs> but she said she wanted to be an Easter egg. I'm like, why? Because they're painted, they're beautiful and all that. It's like, wouldn't you want to be an Easter egg? It's like, no, well, why not? They only get laid once. <laughs> <laughs> but, <laughs> Oh, but in any case, uh, there's another joke someone told me a while back. I don't know where they got it from, but apparently there was an old couple. Had a very nagging wife. Oops, sorry. Had a very nagging wife that uh, went on vacation with, and this is, makes things even worse, right? You're kind of in, in a hotel room stuck with them. Well, they've been married for 50 years, probably wishing to be divorced for 30. Um, but uh, she has a heart attack and dies on that trip to Jerusalem. Jerusalem. Well, basically it came down to the time to decide. Uh, would you bury her here? It would only cost you a hundred bucks. Or do you want to ship her back to the States to be buried in her hometown for five thousand dollars? And he chose the second option. I'd rather have her buried over in her hometown, five thousand dollars. Why? It's so much cheaper to be buried in the homeland of your religion, right? It's like, I don't know. I mean, I heard some guy got buried here, rose again three days later. I can't take that chance. <laughs> now, this next joke is too hard to memorize because it's, it's long, and I had a piece of paper here. All the jokes fit on this one piece. Uh, fuzzy hands. <laughs> Try typing with these, you know. <laughs> oh, I was opening from the wrong side. Ross, <laughs> <laughs> Ross, <Bus>, help me. <laughs> Thank you very much. I have here. One of the symbols of Easter. <laughs> yes, it smells like plastic, it's fake. I have a lot of boob jokes to go along with that, but I'm not gonna tell them tonight. <laughs> now, I wanted to keep this simple for the ending of this act, okay? So this is the last few jokes, but now, Knock, knock. Yeah. Wow, it's responsive. I love that. Ether. Yeah. Ether bunny. Yeah. Who would like this bunny? No way, I got at least a dozen of these. Jokes, I mean. <laughs> knock, knock. Juan. 
Want another Easter Bunny? Yes! Hand that to somebody. Okay. Oh well. S knock knock. Stella. Stella, another Easter Bunny. <laughs> Knock, knock. Amanda. 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 I Amanda, another Easter bunny. <laughs> knock, knock. Justin. Justin. Just another Easter bunny. Knock, knock. Samoa. Samoa. Samoa Easter Bunny. <laughs> knock, knock. Dewey. Do we want another Easter Bunny? <laughs> I got a half dozen left. Sorry. <laughs> Okay. Who's knock knock. Who's Barrel. Barrel. Oh, barrel of Easter bunnies. <laughs> knock knock. Russ. Russ. <laughs> Russ wants an Easter bunny. <laughs> Knock, knock. Consumption. Consumption. Consumption do somebody buy all these Easter bunnies. <laughs> hmm. Knock, knock. Cargo. Cargo, beep, beep, and run over all the Easter bunnies. <laughs> Like sharks! Ow. <laughs> hmm. Knock knock. Oh, yeah. Boo. Boo. Don't cry, I'll be here next year. <laughs> <laughs>